Alrighty, let's add let's add a custom image onto your avatar th thumbnail in game. Let's let's do it as quick as possible. So first thing, right click, import new asset. You're gonna find your image that you want. I saved mine onto the desktop for ease of use. Just import the image. I'm just gonna have it here. Next thing you're gonna want to do, go up to game object, 3D object cube. Uh, I'm just going to resize it however I want. Let's make it a little bit more thin. Let's move it off t t t to the side so we get a clear image. Move it up a little. That looks good. Now all, all you have to do now is just uh, Click here, drag your image right onto there, and it'll it'll apply. Looks a little weird on the other side, but thankfully we aren't using that other side. Now uh, you can click on your GameCube and change the shader if you want to remove those lighting artifacts. I'm going to use Poemi Tune because it's basically a staple at this point. <laughs> all right, so all you gotta do now, VR VR Chat SDK Control Panel. Build and publish. A few moments later. Now that we are in the uh, uploading process here, click upload image. Drag your camera around over here so that it uh, lines up with your image properly. I'm just going to get it roughly in place. That looks pretty good for now. I can make changes later if I want. Then just upload. Alrighty, now that we are in game here, uh, if we go into the social menu, we can see that our thumbnail has been uploaded, as you can see. It replaced the uh, static one we had in Unity previously. Also, if you go into the wings menu here and under the, under the profile tab, you'll see it's also a change here. So yeah, that is how you change your thumbnail inside of Unity if you if, if you don't want to pay $9.99 a month for VRChat Plus. So yeah, if this helped you, uh, be sure to give it a like, subscribe, and comment if you want to see more. So yeah.